will you have Alexis to be your wedded wife, to live together according to God's holy ordinance and his directive and the holy state of matrimony? Will you love her, lead her, and comfort her? Honor and keep her in sickness and in health and forsaking all others. Keep yourself only unto her so long as you both will live. I will. Alexis, will you have Joshua to be your wedded husband? To live together according to God's holy ordinance and his directives in the holy state of matrimony. Will you love him, follow him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health and forsaking all others, keep yourself only unto him so long as you both shall live. I will. At this very moment, I know I'm exactly where God meant for me to be, and that is with you. But no matter what, I'll always be next to you. I'll always be your biggest supporter in everything you do. Having heard the intentions of Alexis and Joshua and the explanation of the covenant of marriage, who is giving this woman to be married to this man to become one in the sight of God? Her mother and I. With this ring, I thee wed. And do pledge as your loving husband. And pledge as your loving husband. To strive to provide your every need. To strive to provide your every need. As God is my enablement. As God is my enablement. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit. In the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. With this ring I thee pledge. As your loving wife. As your loving wife. To respond to you with all faith and love. To respond to you with all faith and love. As God is my enablement. As God, as my enablement. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my great delight to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Joshua McKechnie.